The prohibition against eating predators is one of humanity's oldest and most universal food rules. It appears in ancient religious texts, in the practices of isolated tribes, in the instinctive choices of modern consumers who might never have consciously thought about why they do not order lion at a restaurant. It is written into our disgust response, our cultural norms, our legal codes. Why don't humans eat carnivores? After all this exploration, through economics, taste, toxicology, and tradition, perhaps the truest answer requires us to look in the mirror. We do not eat predators because we recognize something of ourselves in them. We are hunters, strategists, apex consumers who reshaped the entire planet to suit our needs. We stand at the top of the food chain, not through sharp teeth or powerful jaws, but through intelligence and cooperation. We are, in our own way, the ultimate predators. And perhaps on some deep, unconscious level, we understand what predators have always known. Eating your fellow apex predator is where the circle of consumption must end. To prey upon predators is to consume concentrated risk, to take into yourself all the accumulated dangers of the food chain. It is where efficiency gives way to diminishing returns, where the mathematics of ecology says stop here. The predator's paradox resolves itself not in conquest, but in recognition. We spare the carnivores not out of mercy or sentiment, but because we have learned through bitter experience, through observation, through the patient accumulation of wisdom, that some meat is not meant to be eaten. Hit that like button and then subscribe to enjoy more useful videos like this.